All right, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome back to Hollow Knight. So, uh, we got a crossroads. Oh, I fixed I fixed the lag issue. Going onto the public beta fixed it. It's not my computer, guys. By the way, it was not a memory leak issue. It was not lack of RAM. It was not an underpowered machine. It it's Unity, and I thank you for your uh, for your attempts at helping. But it, it most definitely is an issue with the game. Uh, I got somebody being like, your computer's not good enough, get more RAM, and I'm like, I've got, like... Uh, shoot, do I have... I think I have only 16 gigs. I guess that could... I could get more than that, but still. Anyway! Uh, so we got... we got things to look for. Um... This might be a bit of a piecemeal episode. Honestly. As... The, uh, the thing that I want to do here... Is, uh, I think I'm actually gonna run this build at least for a little while. Oh, there's one. Okay, there we go. That's all I needed. Uh, the, th the things that we're looking for are called mask flies. So we're gonna do the, uh, the hunter's journal. We're gonna finish that off. Uh, we've, we've actually only got a couple of things left to kill, uh, before we're, before we're actually complete. And I think we're actually done with the, uh, the Venus flytrap. Yeah, Fool Eater. Okay, so we're done with that. So I've got a guide up here. Uh, you guys can't see it, unfortunately, but, uh... I can put my cursor over everything and see what I'm missing. So right now what I'm missing is something called a Mask Fly. Um... Which is in the... Oh! Oh, thank you. Th thank you, people. Uh... So Mask Flies are actually totally passive enemies. And they, uh, they will run away from you. And so that's why I've never killed one, because I didn't even realize they were fightable, sort of. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're going to, uh, follow this guide pretty much all the way to completing this hunter's journal. I could go looking for things on my own, but that would take way too long. Okay, uh, let's figure out where I am. So we're here. We need to get up and over. It's probably the fastest way to get through here. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to finish the Hunter's Journal first. I- I really wanna- want the last boss here to actually be, like, the- the last... last boss, if that makes sense. Like, it always bugs me when I play a game and you beat the last, you know, last boss, you get the good ending, and then it's just like, by the way, here's all the bonus content, and it's just like, uh, I don't really wanna... I just kinda wanna... I just kind of want to, you know, be done with the game and feel like this sense of finality. It always sucks ending a series on like, well, I finished the bo bonus content and it's just like... Bleh, bleh. Man, I don't know. Anyway, so we're looking for... Mask flies along the way here. Unfortunately, I don't entirely know what I'm looking for. Uh, let's pull this up again. Supposedly, they spawn here. I don't see a single one. We could try and get them to respawn. I'm just gonna keep looking. We've got like several areas just around here. That should have them. At least somewhat nearby. Uh, looks like there's a whole bunch, two chambers to the right from here. Like, they're- they're largely in the center. Yeah, it's not these guys. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about, uh, right now I'm gonna try and find everything. Um, I guess we could try and kill everything, too. Okay, we got one more room. Before there's a mass fly. They should be in here. Found them. Okay. How many of those do I need to kill? Mask fly. 13 more. Oi. Okay, do they respawn? They do. Good. Well, that'll make this easy. All I have to do is pretty much just decimate this group here. Actually, that'll, that'll make this a little bit easier. Of course, now I'm out of soul power, so I gotta hit him regularly.
There we go. So there's there's one enemy that we've totally missed. So that's the mask fly. I'll read the I'll read the thing later. So what do we got next on the on the list? Uh, let's see. So we've got everything here. This mask charger. Okay, Durandu. I know I'm gonna have to kill some Durandus and Durandas if I want to complete it. And it looks like there's yep, there's at least one. Okay, so I want to go over Durandu. So we're good. Massive Moss Charger, Moss Knight, Mossy Vagamon, Durandu, Duranda. Aluba. Charge Lumify and Uma. Okay, so we're missing Aluba. Oh! I think I know where the, the Aluba is. Also, this wiki is probably like the one of the uh, nicest things ever. Okay. So anyway, uh, I know exactly where to get, go to get this one. We're just gonna bench warp back to the, uh, to, or the start of Green Path. I think that's, did I even rest there? I have no idea, one way or another, uh, resting at a bench is gonna get us, uh, close to a fast travel. <clears throat> okay, okay, yeah. I'll have to remember to rest at actually one of the, uh, stag ways. But, yeah, it looks like this actually is not going to take nearly as, as much time as I thought. We do, we do want to go through... And hundo everything, probably. Uh, just so we can read all the, the entries. Shouldn't be too hard, like, it's a couple of bees and, you know, every enemy that we haven't run into so far. Once we get all those done, it shouldn't be a problem. Okay, let's rest at the bench. Okay! At a tickle in my chest, and I wasn't sure if you guys could he hear it when I was breathing in. I, I don't know if you guys ever get it, where you're, you've are you like, kind of got allergies and there's just like stuff caught in your, your chest and you're like, I, m maybe people can kind of hear like a slight wheezing when I talk and I'm like, I don't want that. I don't like the feeling either, so let's, let's just uh, deal with that. And then let everybody know about it later on the video. I'm particularly candid. I'm sorry about that if, if it's like particularly bothersome for people. It's just one of those where it's like, I'm honest to an absolute fault. At least in a lot of ways. I also don't have a whole lot of shame. Anyway, uh, let's continue on. So I gotta kill some birds. Oh, speaking of birds... Well, there's one. Uh... Let's hope we only have to kill one. I guess there's a bench in here, isn't there? And it's a short walk back. Here, let's see how many I have to kill. Nope, I only had to kill one. Okay, well that makes life easy on us. So what's the next thing we're missing? I'm just gonna pull up the guide. Okay, so. We already found the Aluba. Uh, we need to go kill some Durandu and Durandas. Okay, uh, let's, let's go do that. I was considering leaving those for later, but honestly, they're actually really easy. Uh, they're a really easy farm, comparatively. I guess let's just bench warp back. I'm not actually sure if this is that much, uh, faster than walking at this, uh, at this distance, but whatever. Uh, but yeah, so... Durandus and Durandu does are kind of annoying because you can't hit them in melee. I don't know if, um, I could hit them with, uh, sword beams. Come to think of it. Like, I actually have no idea on that one. That's okay. Because all we have to do is just go all the way down here. We don't have to worry about the Venus flytraps anymore, and we're good. Yeah, they hang out in the watery section, so all we have to do is wait. A little bit longer. Okay. I've also been on the Hollow Knight subreddit a little bit lately. There's not much there, to be totally honest. It's a pretty quiet subreddit, but go figure. It's not exactly a... It's not a game that, that breeds a whole lot of replayability and so on and so forth. Um, and so... Uh, let's see. No, this isn't that useful. Where are we? Okay, so we want to get over uh, like a room or two. Um, but yeah. <clears throat> so I, I, I was just hanging out there uh, reading some threads just to get a feel for, like, not the community exactly, but, you know, just to see what people are saying. 
And I realized what I was reading was like really intense spoilers and I have no idea if they're spoilers for the graphic novels or stuff that I missed. And I can't talk about it for obvious reasons because, ah. Wow, those, these guys are comically easy once you got the uh, Grover fly. Oh. Well, comically easy in and of the fact that you gotta remember not to get hit by them. Like most enemies here. Don't walk with your map out, I guess. Damn it. You'd think I'd learn after the first one. After restating this fact. Okay, seeing as we're safe here, yeah, we're still going over and we're going down, I believe. I know there's a bunch of them all over the place, I just don't know the exact locations. Oh, sword beams can go up. Well, that's actually super handy. I, I didn't even think about that. Okay. Now, if I remember right, we have to kill a bunch of these. Uh, what was it again? Gulka. You know, let's actually swing through. Oh, I gotta kill Moskian too. Ah, oh, that sucks. Yeah, I gotta kill a lot of things to hunt this. <clears throat> it's a little bit less attractive. Uh, farming some of these. For the most part, I'm pretty good. Like these guys, okay, that's pretty doable. Uh, Flukemon. Man, I don't even... They're probably not too hard to find. Yeah, these guys are gonna be really easy. We're at... we're... We're only missing a couple. Well... I'll... I'll see what I can run across. We might as well kill the Gulkos as we go by. I wonder if they respawn both ways through. Hopefully they do. That'll make my life a lot easier if they do. And if they don't, I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna... <clears throat> we're gonna need a lot of soul for this, though. That's the one thing. I guess if I can kill, like, large groups of them at the same time, that should make this a lot, a lot faster. There's this guy. Not worth that much soul, though. Oh, hey, more Golkos. Okay. Is that the only one? Oh, that's okay. I guess we'll just pick this up. Yeah, hopefully they respawn, or maybe I find a bench nearby, or I don't know, whatever. I I might I might do a lot of the uh, the hundoing off camera, just because I can do that while like a uh, video renders, whereas uh. I, I can do, uh... I, I can do hunting off-camera, but I can't... I can't... Oh, there's another Gulka here. At least they're not as bad as the fungal area. Okay, here we go. Now there's nothing over there to give me more soul. I'm trying to get more soul. I don't think I get any for sword beams, which sucks. Um, but yeah, just... Final restate, restating, uh, I'll probably catch them all off camera just to make life a little bit easier for everybody. A little bit less boring. Okay. Oh, cool. I can attack him from the front. That's super handy. I'll, I still have to figure out where the Duran, Duran does. Okay, so there they are. I feel mild amounts of guilt for for murdering these guys. Okay, so this gets us to the Queen's Gardens, which isn't really that helpful. Uh, where do we go next? Well, I guess I should probably... Oh, that was the Durandus. Uh, let's see, where's the Duranda? Because if they're nearby, I'll go for them. Oh, I know where they are. Okay, bench warping. I'll have to farm some, um, I'll have to farm some soul power before we go. There is actually a charm that I could go get. That would actually make farming a lot easier. Ooh. Yeah, if you can get the King's King's Charm, it actually lets you auto-charge 
your... Uh, it actually lets you auto-charge your soul. I think it costs some some to fit in, though. I could be wrong. Yeah, we gotta figure out where the Mosskin are hanging out, too. It's not these guys. It's, it's a different group entirely. I'm not sure where they hang out. They, like, up above, maybe? I mean, if I can find a small concentration of them, I'm gonna go for it, just because. But it looks like it's mostly, like, Moss Knights and stuff. These guys cannot deal with, uh... These guys cannot deal with infinite sword beams. I gotta say, I I was originally kind of meh about the whole sword beam thing. I've... They, they've grown on me, if only because they're kind of ridiculous. Okay, well, uh, now where? Now what? I guess we go down. I just wanted to check out to see, seeing as we had these these moss knights here, maybe there's some mosskin nearby. The answer is no. Okay, well that's that's fine. So we want to just drop down into the uh, thorn thorn zone. Uh, do we take do we take the detour? Let's take the detour. I I know what's required for the final boss anyway. So we wanna we probably want to go to King Station. I guess I can finish off a couple of the big guys while we're here. Um. This is going to be a bit of a mix. We want to get the King's Charm if I'm going to be... If I'm going to be doing this. It'll just make life a lot easier on us. I really wish there was a faster way to get into the uh, Ancient Basin. There's not, and it's kind of sucks. Okay. Like, I love, I love the Stagway system in this game. And, like, it's really satisfying and stuff like that, but some of the, like, more necessary levels are, like, totally locked behind a, uh... Totally locked behind a wall. I really wish the sword beams would actually... Uh... Uh, give you at least, like, maybe a fraction of the soul, like a quarter or something. Just to have a reason. Well, let's go kill the last guy, seeing as, uh, we only need one more. And it would be kind of silly to leave this opportunity, because normally I like to just kind of avoid them. Okay. Yep, there he is. Yeah, I, I can't even fire it once. It'd be neat if you could actually, like, uh... Not, like, focus, but, like, a different button entirely. That would actually let you just charge your soul meter for running around. But I guess that would make, uh, exploration. Uh, especially early on in the game, really easy. So I can totally see why, like... You know, the developers wouldn't want somebody to have that ability. Okay. Yeah, sword beams are hard to- hard to aim. Pretty good, though. I would use them against bosses, but they're too unreliable for my taste. So I think they will remain my, uh... Nearly exclusive exploration uh, set up here. Okay, so I don't know what to do here. I guess I'll hit up a bench because we've got a little bit to do. Like, I've got a little bit... I've got a lot to do down here, ish. Number of enemies that, uh, I haven't killed enough of. Okay. No, we're not going down. Gotta say, sword beams definitely do make taking out, like, regular enemies really easy. I'm just glad that there's no more lag. Like, that- that weird dumb hang-up thing was weird. At least the developers seem to be, uh, seem to be aware of its existence as, like, a problem. Or at least, uh, Leth is. I saw him post on the forums. But, uh, the Steam discussions have been... ...have been vocal about it. And I'm not saying the developers deserve any kind of hate for anything. It's just a matter of it's a bug that needs to get fixed, and soon. Okay, this is where Cornifer is. Now, this is probably where we're headed. I 
think, have not been paying full attention. Yeah, this looks like it. The palace grounds. This could be a boss fight, actually. I have no way of knowing. I think this is the king, though. A corpse in white armor. There's like a door here. Okay. Could be a guard. It just looks kind of kingish to me. Or this could be a whole level. Worrying. So this is what this whole area looks like. Looks like beforehand. White. A little bit maybe too pristine. I actually really, really wish like... It, w it would have been kind of cool if this entire game had taken place uh, in broken and non-broken. Uh, hollow nest. Anyway. Alright, screw it. Hopefully I don't have to fight multiple of those guys. If I do... Oh, I see, we're going in here. If I do, I'm probably gonna bench back and I'm gonna put on a build that doesn't, uh... That isn't garbage. The White Palace. Oh. Oh, there's a bench, good. Okay, so let's get rid of Quick Slash, let's get rid of Grub Song. Let's just throw on our standard two. I would do other things, but this seems like a good idea. Unfortunately, I'm flying completely blind here. Oh, I can't get in. Okay, I guess we gotta come in from the top. Oh, luckily I've got some mad sword hopping skills. I, I was reading a discussion post actually from somebody who had never figured out how to sword hop and they're like, getting through this area is impossible and I'm just like, what are you talking about? Like, this is mad easy. Okay. Nope, nothing around there. Alright, does that mean boss fight? It seems like it means boss fight. I have no idea. Ah, screw it. There's another one, isn't there? No, there's not. That was the only one. Huh. Yeah, sword beams would probably be worth it, but, uh... You know, I'm me. Let's see, what do we got around here? Another one? No. Okay, hey, that turns on the lights. It gives us a proper little shortcut. Okay, let's explore this zone. Worst comes to worst, I fall down. Okay, yeah, so there's nothing down there. Okay. Oh, I probably should hit one of these guys with the dream nail. Next time we get the chance. Maybe I can come back here whenever I feel like it for exploration's sake. Okay, so there's probably nothing else over here, so I guess you just go back? I'm confused. I'm not used to having no maps. But there's no way Cornifer has one of this zone. Oh. I can get in here now. An elevator. Okay. Oh. Huh. Okay. No secrets, no nothing? Nothing. Alright, yeah, this would have been much harder if I had a... Uh... I hear people talking. Your light, magnificent and true. 
We will wait, king. We will wait, king. King, your troubles, let us. My king, all for us. My king, all for us. Looks like we've got some things around here. Another bench. I guess I'll sit at it. I assume we get kicked out of the dream once we're done with it. And unfortunately, the dialogue seems to loop, so I'm not too interested in this unless... Some of these guys look unique. Oh, this one's a background one. Okay, and if we drop, it's nothing. I just kind of want to explore. I want to take a look at this. I mean, this is the first time that we've seen quote-unquote functional uh, society here. And I would like... Oh, we're back here. Whoops. Not a big deal. Oh, this is an exit. Well, we don't want to exit yet, do we? We might have to. Either we might have to. Oh, we go this way. Okay. I was wondering why there was an exit there. Okay. What do we got over here? I'm... I'm... Uh, huh, ah! I see. Somebody mentioned these, actually. Very specifically. Ah, okay, so you cannot shadow dash through them. I guess we're just gonna wait. I mean, luckily, we've got a bench in the area, so it makes it a little bit easier on us. Are you... kidding me? Oh. Wow. Huh. This is, um... Whoops. Shoot. That was bad. Well, actually, we do have the, uh, Grub... Uh, grub Song on. So that actually makes us pretty doable. Sort of. Just a giant pain in the butt. Okay. So now we follow it. We hang out directly next to this. Okay, thank you. Freaking saw blades? What? Yeah. Should have known I couldn't have made that. Should have just hung out. Hey. Okay. Yeah, somebody is like, good thing you got this. And it's at the bottom every single time. Holy crap. Good thing you got, uh, hive blood before, uh, before the saw blades. And I was like, what saw blades? These saw blades. 